Yoga for me means many different things and one way to think of yoga is um, movements, physical movements which we call yoga postures and the yoga postures help to bring some ease and stillness to the body and then that allows you to focus on the breath. In terms of yoga and sound, there's so first of all there's an idea that the world is in a constant state or form of vibration. So how we speak, how we act, what we say has kind of vibrations. Um, and yoga isn't just about the physical postures. One element of yoga is called mantra yoga and it's the repetition of sound. So the idea of the sound in yoga has the same impact as the physical postures. So the more you repeat the sound, uh, hopefully the calmer or quieter you'll become. I think that's why people like music, because it makes you feel good and hopefully releases emotions. So the series here at Nottingham Contemporary will focus on some simple postures. So it could be hand movements, could be um, how we sit or laying down. As well as the movement, there'll be focus on breath, so how the breath is and also sound. So the sound will be related to the different chakras and the chakras are seven different energy points which go along the spine. And we begin with the root chakra and each chakra has a particular association. So for example, grounding, calming or soothing. So it's a way for people to experience yoga in a very accessible manner. And the yoga can be done seated, laying down and I've mentioned this but no fancy clothes just come as you are and I, I think of the idea of us coming together and a gathering of practice and to really uh, for me the idea is to alleviate some stress uh, for the body and the mind and to have a sense of ease and release after the practice.